It is the start of fifth grade for seven kids at Snow Hill School. There is Jeffrey, who hates school. Oh, another year of school. Jessica, the new girl, smart and perceptive, who is having a hard time fitting in. It was my first day of school. I was nervous, the sweaty palms and dry mouth. After all, I just moved to a brand new place. Luke, the brain. I like school. I'm good at it. I get all A's. Peter, class prankster and troublemaker. It is our bad luck to have teachers in this world, but since we're stuck with them, the best thing we can do is get a brand new one instead of a mean old fart. Anna, whose home situation makes her an outcast. I don't say much at school. I never raise my hand. That would be an easy way for people to notice me. I didn't want to be noticed. And Alexia, a bully. Your friend one second, your enemy the next. Like I have this new guy for a teacher, that is so cool. Only Mr. Trupp, their new teacher, seems to know how to deal with them all. He makes the classroom a fun place, even if he doesn't let them get away with much. Until the snowy winter day when an accident changes everything, and everyone. You could hear big, heavy snow boots thumping the sidewalk until we turned the corner and dashed out onto the field. I didn't want anybody to get hurt. Peter had it coming. I got him good. So did Lukester. They say all is fair in war. Why did I go along with Jessica's plan? I should have said no. I do not think any of us were merciless on our attacks on Peter. I was running away from Peter, so I did not actually see it. I saw something else, the twisted faces of Danielle, Anna, and Jessica. I did not want to hurt anyone. I wish I could take it back. I did not mean to throw it. Please let my teacher be okay. Read Mr. Terrupt to find out what happens. Terrupt, dollar word. <laughs>